Chicago. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. I was kind of, I was expecting um, a movie. This isn't a movie. It's a play that's on film. This whole damn movie was filmed on a, a, a stage. How the hell this movie cost millions of dollars to make? It's not like they had to fly to Berlin and film here and fly to Australia and film a scene here. No, it's all on one stage. Was Richard Gere that expensive? And I heard a lot about Chicago and I did not think it was the best movie of 2002. But, you know, it got the Oscar for Best Picture of the Year and whatnot. But, um, Chicago will not be on my list of overrated movies because of one song. He had it coming. He had it coming. He only had it I like this song. And that's, again, only because I saw it in an anime music video. So because of He Had It Coming, it's spared. So I know what you're thinking. So what musical are you thinking of? What musical is going to be on your overrated list? I have an idea. How about I just pick one that makes everybody happy? How about we just do one we can all agree on? How about, I'm, gonna, I'm sorry, I'm going to be chicken now. I know I had guts to bash Fahrenheit 9-11 and Passion of the Christ, and I am going to be growing testicles when you see my number one pick, overrated movie pick, because I know I'm going to get hate mail for my number one overrated pick. But... I'm going to play it safe for number six and just pick one we can all agree on. High School Musical. Thank you. Good night. Do I really have to explain why it's on the list? Do I really have to? <laughs> now you're saying, have you seen it? Hell no. Then how do you, it shouldn't be on your list because you didn't watch it. I don't have to. I don't have to. I already know what it's about. A musical number every like five friggin' minutes. That much I know. And what I have seen about this, I said to myself, well, you know what? I'll have South Park explain it for me. This is cool. This is cool. We are really getting old, you guys. Says this DVD sold more copies than any DVD ever made. They just released part three in theaters and it made 80 million opening weekend. Well, I'm out, guys. If this is what's cool now, I think I'm done. I no longer have any connection to this world. I'm gonna go home and kill myself. Okay, High School Musical lost me when I saw in the previews they started breaking out in song and dance before a basketball game. And it wasn't like this was the Glee Club. These were the basketball players! The basketball players are going to break out in song and dance? This would have been inconceivable for me 15 years ago. Because I live in a jock town. Let's just get that straight. I live two blocks away from a football stadium, so I'm surrounded by sports nuts everywhere. And I know none of them are going to break out in song and dance. Dance, maybe, but here's their song and dance. Woo! 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 We rock you suck! Yeah! Beer! Beer! <laughs> I'll bet you all saw number five coming miles away. Miles away. <laughs> The only thing is, a lot of people are going to be mad that this is number five and not number one. And I know I'm going to get hate mail and death threats for this anyway, but I don't care. Number five on my overrated movies list, I simply dub the... The Audience Choice Award. And I told people that I was making this list for overrated movies. Like, 80% of people told me to put this movie on the list. Like... It wasn't even close. Like, hands down, everybody told me to put this movie on my overrated list. It wasn't even close. A lot of people told me. Including girls. Just want to say it for the record. Okay. I think you know what it is. It's a recent movie. It recently came out, but because it came out in 2009, it makes it just in my list. Oh, I forgot. Um, is it Critics' Choice, Money, or Word of Mouth? Um... Again, I'm going to have to go with all three. Well, let's just go with money. Well, we'll go with money. Because
because word of mouth is at best mixed. And critics also are mixed about this. So we'll just go with the money. <sighs> you all saw this coming. Here come the fangirl death threats. Twilight Saga, New Moon. Okay, moving on. Let's go to number four now. No, oh, I can't get off that easy. I can't. I. I'm not. I, I cannot get off that easy. Nope. We're going to be here for the whole ten minutes, aren't we? Yep. Yep. Time to put the list to a screeching halt once again. We're going to just spend the whole time talking about Twilight. Am I really going to jump on board the Twilight bandwagon? Am I going to be just another YouTuber going to bash this to death? Well, of course I am. 